So starting off here, I've just taken both wastegates off. Um, and we're changing the springs. So it had a 14 pound spring in it, but it was only boosting 10 pounds. You broke it. Wait, is he just shitting me? Oh. So unsure why. Um, a few of the fittings were slightly loose, not really loose, so that may have been the problem. Um, Ooh, we need that. Don't lose that. But anyway, we're going to put another small spring in it. So that's a 14 pound. This is a three. Hey. So that's going to take it to 17 pounds. Which one did it come out of? Can't. How'd it fall out? I undid it. How else did it fall out? Oh, because I need to get that off. Because you're shit. Look, the O ring's gone. That'll be why. Oh, that's we're why. It's not we're losing boosting. Boost. Wow. That's a bad time. I might have one in my work. Well, truck. there's the problem. Why is that gone? It's not like I use this car much. Well, there you go. There's the problem. Hey. Um. Well, okay, wow. we're going to have to sort that now. Yeah. But anyway, how I was talking about the screen pipe touching the shaft, instead of just welding it a bit longer, I'll just hit it a bit so it's got a bit more clearance now and it should be sweet, no more binding. What the fuck? That's weird, then one of the other ones are the same. Yeah. That was short lived. Wow. Yeah, look, that one is fucked as well. O rings come out. That's pretty random. We have taken them apart maybe three or four times, so yeah. they may have got a bit damaged, but it's only recently started to lose um, boost. So I'm glad we found it now. Yeah. Find a new O-ring, hopefully, and we'll be back pumping again. That must've been down on so much power. Fuck yeah. That's gonna bloody haul now. After that skid. Ooh. Yeah, that wouldn't have helped too, how hot it would have got. No. So I had a kind of smart idea, but it's a bit difficult. As you can see, there's a hill. I'm trying to get the Evo off. Obviously, it doesn't start. And obviously, I couldn't push it up the hill, so I had to unload it, move the ute forward, and try try roll it off by myself. And the handbrake doesn't work. So, it went flying into the fence. Oh boy. Now we're gonna try and drive the ute forward and hope this stays here and slips out. Well, that was interesting. We've done it. Um, wrecked the lawn. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Mum's gonna be pissed. What the? All right. Another day because we had to wait for some O rings. Kodor has come to the rescue with about <laughs> 10 of the bastards. So if we have this problem again at the track or something, we we're going to have spears. spears. So, we're going to put these wastegates back together. Now I've got Arkai. And, uh, yeah, we'll be on. And you didn't say when you're about to weld. Yeah, you know, yeah. When a golfer says full when they tee off. Well, well, when you say weld. Eyes. Eyes. No. <laughs> Look away. Oh. Oh, okay. <laughs> What do you reckon? We're all okay. full at <laughs> So I'm um, going for a quick test drive, but windy. Um, it was boost cutting, so just plug the greedy e manage back in, it seems sweet now. And it's like 16 pound, AFRs are sweet, it's so quick, and the extra grip's so good, so we'll do one little pull for you. <laughs>
well, that is a big success. That's the best the car's ever felt. She is pulling like a schoolboy. Um, and it's actually running like 16, 15, 16-ish, 16 which is probably better. I didn't really want to go up to 17 on the stock ECU. But um, AFRs are mint, like it's 11s all day. So she's healthy. Stock ECU, loves it. Now I thought I'd show you guys this. Um, so I think I've done one service on this thing since it's been back from Japan, this engine, which is probably a year ago now. She's had a very big beating and this is what the oil turns out like. It's a bit difficult to do with one hand. It is still golden after so much abuse. That is, that's unreal man. This Jay-Z can do it. <coughs> Want to know what oil I use? It's actually uh, diesel tractor oil. And it loves it. Detergents and the diesel oil is clean this thing out. How you do? This is the healthiest Jay-Z on the planet. <laughs> What are you muttering there? Still got a drift. Oh, you'll see. Repeat. Repeat. You wanna see you wanna see clean oil? Come over here, mate. It's not even on the dipstick, you can't see it, mate. <laughs> you need a longer dipstick. That clean! Yours hasn't been beaten. <laughs> no, it's actually <coughs> Did you just do it? Yeah, and he just did it. Never you service it too much. You're not supposed to service Jay-Z's that much. Well, you are. That's why it stays strong. <laughs> mm, like Gaz is checking my camber. Ideally I want about six dig. Five eight. Check the other side. This is probably not the most accurate way of doing it, but gives you a relative idea. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because I just done a quick eye alignment. Um, so when I climbed under the other days, Ooh. what's that? I think one side's got more. 4.8. Oh, I might try and match that side You're to like that. A then. Whole dig out. Yeah. Um, so one thing I noticed when I climbed under um, yesterday is that the lower arms weren't pushed all the way out. Eccentric bolt was pulled all the way in, so I adjusted them and tried to max them both out. So I've got a little bit more camber. Um, and I just done an eye alignment on the toe because it put it way out. And it actually just felt very good then. So I'm just going to quickly give her a bit of a measure with the slip toe plates. Just to get a rough idea what it's at. But I need to do or get alignment and alignment before the weekend anyway because... The rear is crook, the thrust angle is crook and it's crabbing, so... What's it between five? Heaps. Well... <sighs> what the... Brain explosion. Josh has got this car in the booth. Um, doing the metallic white. Panda white. <sighs> Custom colour, one all. So... Yeah. This paint job's probably worth about six grand. Yeah, spent heaps. Hard work on it, you know. A lot of prep work. But I mean, oh at the end of the day when I put this fender into this guy's door, I mean, it's, it's, it's not going to matter. Then I just go to the track, make, make the round. Oh. Don't have a look at the back of his car when he tried to take me in. Yeah. It's fixed up. Oh. Look, new panel. This is when Gazza spun out and reamed him. No, I'm <laughs> on you. you fucking spun out in front of me. Hey, yeah. So, hang on. I fall in front of you. What? I spin out and you're drifting. How's the white hit that red corner? He's got a full pitch. He's got a full 360 and I try to swim out of the way. Hey, clipped your bash bar. Let me jog your memory. Oh, fuck that. <laughs> you slowed down in front of me. Nah, it's because the guy in front of us spun out. Yeah. Some walking. Oh, okay. 
So it's actually a line of rookies. Us and three. <laughs> so we told Josh, driver's info, cars must be presentable. <laughs> and this is what he does. Well, I mean, like, uh, it's like four different colours, so. Funny thing is, it will look good in pictures, but for anyone that goes up close, oh! Don't look up close. No show cars for sure. Black and white, eh? Yeah. Two tone. I ran out of um, white and I can't afford to buy more cans, so I'm just gonna have to make this black and the boot black. What? <laughs> so it's gonna be like black on the front and sides, and then the sides will be white. Yeah. I really don't know. But I mean, at least it'll be like kind of two colours instead of like five. So, yeah. Should be. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. <laughs> this is the definition of catfish. The trick to these. Oh, yeah. Nice it's coverage. Just, it's just to, to hold in one spot for about five seconds and then just. Yeah. That's how you paint. Just let it run. Yeah. Run a hunger. From a distance it looks pretty good. That's what we're just saying, like in pictures and from far it'll look good, but yeah. just don't go up close. Just as soon as I pulled up I was like, fuck you. Yeah. Looks pretty hectic, but who? Edwitter. Fuck. Tip boy. Tip you are. KTP here quick. Too much. <laughs> <laughs> Oh boy. Come into the face, I think. What? You're gonna move quick and move. Come on! You're drinking non alcoholic. What is this? Mm. 2020. <laughs> oh shit. 2020. <laughs> new year, new him. <laughs> How to fit a 326 wing with Josh and Cordell. Alright, it's too hot. Manu time. Low tide. Oh. It is drowning. Right, I'm going to Manu off there. <laughs> oh, made it. You mate? Know, uh, hot ball over there. That's the technique. Not bad, good size. We need height for perfecting the form. Yeah. What a day out. Spread <laughs> <laughs> like a frog. <laughs> In your blood. <laughs> Struggling there, boys. Up, up, up! Where's your strength? Up, boys! <laughs> Holy shit! Yeah. Hurry up! <laughs> Easy. Um, okay. Cordell's gonna jump in the jacuzzi here. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> All of five minutes sanding. 10 minutes sprain, painted and mounted his wing. I don't know, eh? I mean, I suppose it looks <laughs> better, but boy oh boy. So I think we're pretty much ready to go. Uh, I just gotta get an alignment, which I'll be getting in the next few days. So I think we're all locked and loaded now. I just quickly loosened off the preload on my rear um, to try get some more like mechanical um, grip, I guess you could say. Um, obviously, you know, I was talking about doing springs, but I couldn't find something. Ethan from Cooper Tires recommended uh, that Redline sell springs, 22 kg springs, but they were uh, out of stock, so unfortunately, I couldn't get some. So I'm just leaving it how it is, and we'll see how she goes after I get a wheel alignment. Um, there's a lot being changed since I last drove, so it should be interesting. So yeah tomorrow we're loading up and we're out so let us know what you guys want to see uh, i'm not sure if we'll record driving the trip there um let us know if you want to see that and let us know what you guys want to see 
at the event too. Oops. Um, because obviously Saturday we're not driving and we're only driving the Monday and non-stop driving footage gets boring to be honest so yeah let us know we'll see you in the soup <coughs> <coughs> wake up junior <laughs> what say that again what's your mouth what do you say 